It's an exciting day here at WSU. It is move in weekend. So we came down here today to ask students what they're thinking and feeling about the news surrounding the Pac-12 conference. Moving into your first year at WSU is usually an exciting time. I don't think it's all gonna fit, so we'll see. We'll find out, yeah. <laughs> But that excitement may be a bit weighed down right now because while these students are moving in, several Pac-12 members are moving out of the conference. I'm heartbroken. Uh Andy Guerrero couldn't believe the news about the Pac-12's collapse. As a senior, he's glad he got the full WSU experience before these big changes happened. So the main reason I came to WSU, I wanted to be part of like a big like D1 school. Uh, for me, I love sports. But his heart goes out to the new class of WSU students. He's actually helping move in this weekend. It's uncertain what's going to happen next year. So I think the freshmen this year are going to come and like, or even everyone's just, just going to come and try and get the most out of it this year. Here's how it breaks down. USC and UCLA left the Pac-12 conference last summer for the Big Ten. That opened the floodgates. Last month, Colorado left for the Big 12. And over the weekend, UW and Oregon announced they joined the Big 10. And Arizona, Arizona State, and Utah joined the Big 12. That leaves WSU, Oregon State, Stanford, and Cal in the Pac-12 for now. And this also puts the future of the Apple Cup in limbo, leaving WSU fans to wonder, will the Cougs get another chance to fill this empty case? A few years ago when we played them in Seattle, we won and we ended up rushing the field like WCU, like we all came together and we were all like unified. Um, but without the Apple Cup anymore, it's like that rivalry is just not going to be the same. And I just I feel for the freshmen. While the future of the Pac-12 conference may be uncertain, there is one thing that is certain. It doesn't matter where WSU plays, Cougar pride remains strong. Once a cougar, always a cougar. And it's just like, that. that's never going to change. In Pullman, Amanda Rowley, Creme 2 News.